I'm stunning, nigga. Rich gang, 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 gang. Got it. What the hell are you doing in here throwing up set? You ain't got no job. What's good, NHG squad? This is your boy, NHG. Well, my camera come back for another video. B. And today, I will be giving you my opinion, my review on Anthem. The hype of the game. The game was supposed to kill Destiny or maybe Division 2. I don't know, but this was the game supposed to be. The, the the biggest the biggest game came out on 2019 um i'm gonna give you a couple little you know maybe a little good good um good view on the well i'm gonna say good view good positive on this game now the game is is good it is good i like the flying i, I like the graphics especially if you're playing on the xbox one x and that that that, that, that true 4k on it the graphics is good real good you feel me but other than that I, I like the gameplay i like the movement I, I like the um you could customize your own what you call it grab oh my gosh um oh my gosh that's what uh <laughs> i totally just like forgot about the uh, name of this suit jog jogging whatever leave it down in the comments if you know what i'm talking about i just can't get the word out um, I'm sorry on that part, but under that you can customize your character and your Iron Man suit I'm just gonna say that Iron Man suit. You feel me? Because it's almost like an Iron Man Iron Man like you playing as Iron Man, but under that you customize Iron Man um, The purpose of this game, you know, it's a loot and shoot you loot you shoot you grind for that, you know that good armor that that good weapon, you know, let everybody know you better than everybody else in the lobby so you should be really really familiar of what type of game is this story mode eh, it's not that great i feel like the um the characters on there just plain i feel like they just throw any actor give them a, a um a quick check and you know just do whatever i feel like the acting on the game they didn't do too good on the acting that's just my opinion i, I didn't like that the, the face expression was just horrible. I didn't like it, but other than that, um, flying around the, I won't say around the world, but flying around the map, it's, it's, oh my God, it's good and it's bad. Cause I feel like when you fly, when you fly somewhere, you want to see something, something nice, beautiful, you know, and even though it's a loot and shoot, you know, some monsters and all that, you still want to see something nice and part of that map you feel me and I'm kind of not getting that from this game now, I have not seen anything you know real 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 nice to make me just stop and be like oh my gosh this is great but under that I still like the flying I, you could play what um, free roam you could roam the map you could do whatever you want to do now on the E3 trailer, so no the E3, they show you something that you know you was gonna. To me, it felt like you was gonna fight this big ass monster, and you and your three teammates is gonna go after it and 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 just slay this monster, man. Let them know you the boss. You feel me? I have not seen that, and there's a lot of stuff missing from the trailer to the game actually came out. What happened when you was in your um, what you your um, your lobby and you see this big ass machine just walking? What happened? Why did they cut that out? That was real nice. You feel me? I don't know why they even didn't did anything like that. But it's a lot of stuff. It has been been cut out off, off, you know, off the off the game from the trailer. So it's it's kind of sad. But I, I don't know what's the reason why from them doing that. Now I want to talk about some of the um the problems I had with this game. You know I did bought it day one. I pre ordered the game. If you have people who know me, you know I, I pre ordered my games automatically and just you know wait till it come out. When I pre ordered this game, when I saw the trailer, I was like, wow, this is a game I want to play. This game I want to you know spend hours and hours on it, just like you know you playing Destiny. You feel me? That just wasn't the case for me when I was playing this game. 
it doesn't have what can I say? It doesn't have a lot of game modes, you know, to for you to just, you know, to go do. I've been I've been playing this game for like good five hours, maybe like ten. Just so you know, I wanna get the feel of it, you know what I'm doing and all that. And when I realize I've been doing the same old thing. Hours and hours. You go to a strong point, you hold it, kill a whole bunch of monsters, hold it, kill a bunch of monsters, hold it, kill a bunch of monsters. And you're probably gonna kill a big monster after that after all that happens. And it's it gets it get kind of tiring doing that. You know, when you play in Destiny or Division, you have that opportunity to do a whole lot of stuff. You playing Destiny, you playing, you know, team deathmatch, you playing um um, what's that car? I forgot the name of that. Oh, that's the name. We it's like you and six players, and you do this big ass. I played it one time, but it was just so comp so much complicated. You gotta do a bunch of stuff. But Destiny gives you the options to do a whole lot of stuff, so you don't have to be sitting there and keep doing the same old mission that you're doing on Anthem, and and it's kind of sucked that you have to do that. This game could have been the, the biggest game for 2019, but it honestly failed to be the biggest game. It failed. It's now, you can look up on YouTube, there's a lot of news about, you know, Anthem fell off. I joined a couple of matches, you know, and I was by myself. And come and find out, it, the player count has went down. So, it that... That make a lot of sense why I've been joining lobbies and I've been, you know, being by myself sometimes. And another thing, you know, logging into the game, y'all should know about this. Logging into the game takes for a, a good minute or so for you to join the game or trying to change the color of your, your Iron Man suit. It's just, it's just crazy. Me falling off the map, going down under the ground, the map, I'm just falling for no fair reason. That's that. I, I hate that. Uh, lags, uh, I don't like it. Glitches, I don't like. It was one time I was stuck between. Uh, I think I was stuck between a tree, and my my damn Iron Man suit kept on jumping back up and down, up and down so fast. I'm like, what the hell? I'm stuck in this in this place, and I couldn't get myself out of it. But soon as I got myself out of it, that was just ridiculous. How what I went through with this game I mean I'm telling you I've been like there's been a lot of glitches in this game that they need to be fixed ASAP now you probably ask me well why the hell you playing this game you know it's, it's basically broke because I feel like this game have potential I feel like it's going to come back I just don't know when it's going to come back I don't know when it's going to be that big old update and it's sad that you have to buy a half working game to get the full of the game to get your full experience with the game so that's kind of suck when you deal with these type of games and you know ea has been you know slacking with um battlefield 5 uh, i know they made, i know they came out with apex but other than that anthem is a big to me is a big fail right now and i'm hearing that this game probably they probably not even gonna make another anthem man yeah, I think I. It's on. I know it's on. It's on YouTube. So, um, I was watching the video, but was, it was a game um, news all the. Well, game news YouTube, and it said this. They had a ten years plan with this game, but they, I, I think they cut it down to a three year plan, and that's a shame when you don't have faith in your game. Now this game had um what identity crisis. They didn't know what to name it. Or that you know they took the fly off, they put it back on. It was just a lot of what this game was supposed to be. That's and that's sad. That's really sad. That if the people who made the game doesn't even know what type of game is it, why would you, you know, promote a game that you don't even 100% sure this game is gonna be really good enough? Now, I mean, the trailer was on point. That's what it sold me. The trailers. I, I think I saw a couple. I saw a couple of gameplays, but you know, these business will lie to you just for you to buy the games. And I, and I, you know, I fell for it. I spent that eighty dollars, you know, to get that 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 nice suit that they were showing. But eighty dollars for a suit 
and a gun I, I you know it should have been more than that you feel me I should have been getting more than or this a suit and a gun but whatever I don't really care are they coming out with DLCs I don't know but I feel like they need to they need to be coming out with um events they need to be doing a, a, a whole lot of something and not a whole lot of nothing on this game they've been they did come out with a couple of updates to fix some you know some problems but this game still have a lot of problems and they still need to work on well anthem you know will rise again and be that game that is going to be i don't know you just have to sit down and wait basically i kind of i I stopped playing it for a good minute, but you know maybe I will go back on there when I hear that new update is gonna be a big change whenever that's going to be. And I mean, <laughs> I don't know what to say, but if you think about picking up this game, and want to play it? If I was you, slow it down. This game will play you. Don't buy this game yet. Don't buy it. Wait till it get on sale. Wait for that big update. Once that big update comes and, and change a whole lot of a whole lot of stuff, then go grab it. And and I guarantee you, you're going to find it. It's going to be on sale too, on top of, of the big update. So people want to ask me, this is a Destiny killer? Nope. Or this is a Division killer? Nope. Division two killed it. I mean, I'm playing Division two more than I'm playing Anthem. I'm, that, that, I'm just speaking the truth, and I will be coming my my review on on um Division Two real soon, and some couple of gameplays. But I will put a gameplay of my um of me playing Anthem. I got a lot of reviews coming up real soon, but Anthem is not there yet, and I'm sorry that I I, I have to say it. I got to speak the truth. I thought this game was gonna be awesome, but it's not awesome yet. And that's sad. But I hope you like this video. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, leave it down in the comments what you think about this game. And oh, and I heard that if you put this game on PlayStation, that it broke your um, console. That, that's sad. Well, but this is your boy Energy One Mike. Subscribe, comment, and like. And stay tuned for whatever you'll be posting on next. If you have any comp, you have anything about this game, leave it down in the comments. If you like it, you hate it, leave it down in the comments, man. But this is your boy Energy One Mike. Subscribe, comment, and like. And I'm out of here, be deuces.